to this I don't know how to act, don't know how to adapt to this situation Not used to this, no I'm not I better let myself Give in to love, believe in us No matter what it does to my heart Not used to this, no I'm not It was like if we were to waste These moments The light poets to me Hello YouTube, Steve Trucker here. We have just loaded, so we're not going to be showing the outside camera at this stage. I'll pop you on once we're off the customer site, so you don't see the customer site for obvious reasons. Just making sure we don't, because it's a bit of a chaotic site this one. Yeah, we've done our break as well, which is awesome. Yeah, yeah so we've loaded down in London. Uh, I've forgotten roughly, it's sort of near like... Uh, ooh, I'll come to me in a bit. Yeah. On the west side of London, nevertheless. North-west-ish. South of uh, Wembley and all that. Roughly. It's a rough location, so we're going to make our way through. I think it's, uh, it's not Ipston, just got my head <laughs> where, we're, where we are, I don't want to say the company name, but uh, nevertheless, we're going to go through London, make our way to the M4, then M Tray 5, up to M3, to a farm near Long Parish, or Burble. And then I think we are either going up to South Wales, Quickly load, run to a plant sort of Gloucestershire, Gloucestershire sort of way, then home. But we'll see. If I didn't say at the beginning, today is the 7th, Monday the 7th of December. And so we're doing a bit of a day vlog today. Hope you've enjoyed the new type of intros I'm doing. I did originally vlog yesterday, but uh, let's say something happened yesterday and I got a bit, not moody about it, but I just didn't want to make it a negative vlog. I'll do a video on it in the future though, because it, it's definitely an issue. I, it, yeah, it's not just unique to our industry, but uh, it tends to come with uh, some unique issues because of our industry. But it is what it is, it deserves its own video in its own right. I'm not even going to mention it in this one really, aside from what I've just said. Right, so we've got Ford's equipment fitted to our truck now, so if you, can, you, if you do hear a thing, you might not hear it, but uh, our truck says when it's turning. Uh, anybody going to let it out is the big question of the day. Maybe this Mercedes driver, if he has any pre-fires in the petrol station. Right, let's take him. We do have a story because we should get out the Ford in. Thank you very much. All right then, don't acknowledge, fine. <laughs> so it's all right, it is what it is. Yeah, so, make your way up through here. You might, as I might put the camera on imminently. From now. Ah, Acton. It says it on the bridge, Acton. <laughs> Action at Acton. Yeah, I did actually think of something quite funny to say to start the intro of the video off today, but I just completely forgot it. Also, that reminds me, I need to remind myself later, so for the outro, I need to do a couple of shout-outs, hopefully. So, I, one of them has asked for a shout-out, and I will give him a shout. Trust me, I will. I'll just It's more down to if I remember. But nevertheless, Everly Sports Channel, as I always say, you're seriously very much appreciated. Uh, just where you're going, you've got a pedestrian crossing, you've got a cyclist to our left. 
I didn't want to overtake the cyclists there for obvious reasons. Just need to keep your head on the swivel in London. Okay, we might get an opportunity. I say we're not full full, but we're, we're kind of over half full, but it's somewhat worse than being full. Because uh, the load does have a habit of trying to, you know, it basically sloshes about. Even though we've got baffles, it just sloshes about an awful lot, so it causes a lot. Yeah, it's a bit harder to accelerate and slow down, obviously. Depend what mood it's in. Oh, just a typical London cyclist. Just go for a red light, why don't you? It, it's perfectly fine. There's no danger there whatsoever. Your cyclists, you're above the highway, highway walls at the end of the day. It is what it is. It's London. It's London, baby. Might be able to snoozy on bike. I don't think we want to be stuck behind the cyclists all the way up. If I can help it, we'll go for that. I'm not going to stop in time for that. Keep an eye on the zebra up ahead. I'm not going to manoeuvre around the cyclists it's too tight. Keep an eye down that back mirror there. Cyclists are going white. No one crossing. Right, there we go. Yeah, sometimes it helps to call out what you're seeing as well. It does aid. But yeah, as you can see, it's London at nine o'clock in the morning on Monday morning, as I would say. We got a red light. Being careful and wary of cyclists. Just do my checks. Be a hundred percent sure. And so cyclists still behind us. Still a bit way behind us, shall I say? It's not a, not an issue at this stage. Let's see what's going on here. Is that car letting people out, or what are they doing? I don't want to cut somebody up. I can help it. Okay, that's power through. There we go. So I should use the same thing, but always check. You never know. But we are going to go left at this junction here. It's good having a, I'll, I'll do a video on, on the Ford's equipment. I've got like a, a TV screen on the left pillar now, sort of thing, very small one, but turns on the cameras while I'm turning. I've got it so it turns off while I'm driving though, because certainly when it's dark, I find it distracting. I've turned it all the way down, so it's not too bad. I, I, I was a bit worried initially when I first saw it start the week, going, because I started like four in the morning, pitch black and it was reflecting a wee bit off the windshield to suss out you could turn it off. Not to turn it off off, but you know, turn the screen off when you're not needing it. And it will just literally pop on when you use your indicators. Which actually is pretty cool. I like that. It's just another aid at the end of the day. I see no issue. I think it's all tied into like a dash cam system as well, because we've got a forward camera. One on the right as well. Which is good and you can use it at night time. But as I said, it deserves its own video to go through it, actually. So, uh, you got that hopefully to come along with a year in the DAF video as well, which I have not produced yet. Just, I mean, a bit here and there this week and just haven't had the right opportunity to do it. So I was actually going to do it yesterday, but I said the truck park was a bit busy and it is a bit awkward to vlog in front of other drivers. And they're, like, they're probably looking at you going, what's that guy doing, speaking into a camera? Uh, come on, baby. We can do it.
Yeah, so I thought I'd, I'd vlog out of London. I'm going to try and keep this vlog a bit more tighter to bring the time down, if I can. So I'll probably end the intro once I get onto the inn before, or near enough. And I'll probably uh, time lapse up towards the customer, up towards Andover, Long Parish, all the way. And then uh, we'll do a bit more. I'll probably come on after that. Tell you where we're going, 100%. Right, so I'm not going to push forward. That car probably should have held out because surely if a truck's holding back, you would think twice about. But no, it is London. Maybe I should be a bit more defensive. Point to note, as they would say. Because the reason I'm holding off, because if that truck pulls out, holds a junction, the car moves up behind them, I could turn left, but I still, if I turn left, there's still a chance I could, you know. So I want to hold off just to make sure, you know, they're not going to be tied up on the white inside, ideally. Trying to dominate the white lane, but not fully, you know, not to deny people fully, but to sort of mention them, think twice. Was that truck's going to come to a stop? It's okay, we're going to pull that off, it just didn't make it any easier, to be honest, than it needed to be. You know, with having the, uh, I think it was a BMW, whatever it was, so white then. I'm just keep left lane, we'll need to get the right lane down here, I believe. It's not my favourite junction down here, but it's not the worst I've ever used. But when it's busy, it's not much fun. So I don't quite do the full speed down here, because you never know what you're about to run into down here. So far, it's, well, it's okay, normal. It's a lot better than it could be. It normally queues up to around here somewhere. Normally. So even if we meet a queue after this bridge, we're actually doing pretty well. I suppose, well, still technically kind of rush hour left, but I suppose after the peak. Which is an advantage. We're just going to get ourselves in the white lane ready to rock and roll. So I won't need an indicator on at the moment. Oh, I'm not too sharp. I'll stay here. It's not very clearly marked. It would help if they had information board saying get into Z lane if you're going right at the roundabout or you know you can stay in certain lanes but hey ho not on this bit of junction all, all the time, not that hyper familiar with it. Just keeping an eye. Because people won't give you um that's probably what I was more getting on about. But nevertheless, you know, hopefully you're enjoying this. I will catch you a bit later. I'll do a time lapse from now. And I'll guess I'll catch you after we've delivered and uh, see where we're going next. Hopefully you're enjoying the new camera and all that. I'll mention what hopefully what it is a bit later. So we're trying you out in the new camera this week as well. The one that's looking at me. And this is all in 4K as well, but might not be released as 4K. So it's all filmed in 4K, but it might be only 1080. I'll see when I edit what I want to do. So I will catch you soon. It's a perfect opportunity. Lights goes red, gives me a safe opportunity to have to switch the cameras over. So I'll catch you in a minute.
welcome back. I'm sorry the time lapse of the camera may have moved a little bit. I do apologise. Things do happen. I fear lies the camera here was a little bit loose as well, so we sorted all that out. Let's boot her up. Just so we're fjord. Just outside Andover. Let's turn that off and that on. Yeah, so we uh, obviously delivered off at near Ando at the farm and we're going to be making our way over to a customer just north of Shipton Mallet more or regular so uh, and then we're taking that load to a farm sort of uh, like it's sort of near sort of Chippenham sort of area in the sticks to a farm So I've uh, got myself a Greg's coffee, some lunch, and when I get to the customer, let's see if I do the... Oh, oh, now you indicate, mister. Oh, I he's had enough warning. Not that I'm bullying myself out, by the way. I would have stopped if he carried on. So, sometimes it takes a look a bit too... Why are we not going back up? There we go. I don't like when uh, <laughs> some of these my uh, alt suspension alteration wasn't doing its thing. So I had the warning lights up. I probably am faster than them, but uh, we'll let it get by. So causing an issue. Be a professional, as I say. Power it on. See if we're faster than it might not be. We might be quicker, you never know. So up to cruise are we gaining? I think we're neutralising more than anything. It's kind of 50-50. So we do put the active cruise on. Let it drag us back a wee bit. And jobs are good at. Yeah, so the delivery went well. It was a, and yes, a light load. So basically, that means it wasn't a full delivery. We only had about 20 ton on of the product. Which is, yeah, positive. It means a quick delivery at the end of the day. So maybe a bit of a hold up and loop, but uh, we'll work around that at the end of the day. Yeah, so. I'm using a new camera, as I alluded to in the last sequence. It's a Sony, uh, I think it's, I'm going to mess it up, it's something like ZX1, I think it is, or something like that, the vlogger's camera I'm using. Which, uh, hopefully it's okay. It, it probably might not be quite as steady as my action cameras, but for what it's doing, I think, the resolution in terms of the image should be, you know, I'm not saying what I had before was bad at all. I mean, I still got it with me, you know, so I've got loads of different solutions. As I saw part of uh, mixing things up, as I say. And changing positions. I I'm actually quite liking the position you're in, to be honest. I do like that. That position. It is convenient when you're down here, but uh, I think it gives you a little bit of side view out the side, a little bit here and there. Not nothing precisely, but uh, enough to give you perspective, hopefully. There you go. A lot of our, even though we've got all the lights on already, else a lot of our fog songs. It seems to be uh, getting a little bit worse, to be honest. This fog. Uh, you know, adjust the conditions. Should clear up by midday, apparently. Might do. It's certainly getting a little bit brighter, in that, otherwise, than getting more foggier. If that makes sense. So it could be burning off as well. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah, so, got this new campaign, Pascot, that said the. Uh, 
Black Friday sales, so I was keeping an eye on it for a while actually. But, and I thought I'd treat myself, this will be my Christmas present. In a way, towards myself this year. Yeah, so, uh, strike any other news really. Nothing massively, as I had an issue yesterday, but that deserves its own vlog. Probably to talk about the kind of issue I experienced yesterday more, more or less, but we'll see. I don't want, as I said, I don't want to make this a negative vlog if I can help it. You know, if something happens today, it happens. We'll talk about it. But, uh, yeah. As I say, things happen. It's all about how you deal with it. And trust me, it's, uh, it's nothing bad on my behalf, to be honest at all. It's just, uh, it's just, uh, as I say, just to talk about, you know, something I feel like isn't talked about very much within the industry. Or when it is, it seems to be brushed underneath the carpet very, very quickly. But we'll see. Why are we slowing down? It's probably fully loaded, that's what it is. I think there's going to go down here in a bit, so I'm sort of wondering. Uh, we'll, we'll give it a go. We'll give it a go. Looks like a car drug slowed him down. Who knows? Okay, but I just want to make sure. Ooh, it's not the worst I've seen lately, but it did cut it fine at BMW. Yes, I must say, over the last week or so, oh, the increase of bad driving I've seen and also my colleagues have seen. Well, it's, been, it's been pretty bad for a long time, to be honest, but it's almost like the asylum's been let go, but I suppose it's that time of year again as they would say. Okay, so what I'll do, as I say, it's only going to be a short, hopefully a short vlog today. It's uh, me just mumbling on about stuff and, uh, and that, but I thought I'd just update you what, where we're at, what we're doing. So we, we delivered off near Long Parish Andover, which I said delivery went well. We're just going to make our way up to ship to Mallet now. And, uh, get it collected and then go over to Chippenham. So the plan is you will have a time lapse probably once we've loaded on the route to uh, to our next customer to deliver and I'll probably do an outro on the route home or when we're parked up. So uh, I will see you once we have delivered and I hope you enjoyed the time lapse of us transiting after we've loaded. Just to give you reference to what you're seeing and when it is. Okay, I'll see you in a few seconds.
this now. Because it's just getting dark. And even though this camera is brilliant, uh, I think I'll just do a time lapse on the way out of here. On the way back, which kind of makes sense, I think. Um, well, our today's gone, so we're delivering at the moment on, on custom site. You can't fully see the site anyway from here, so <laughs> it's rolling the cab, let's say. Well, at least, as far as I interpret it. <laughs> yeah, so all's good. Making a delivery, it should go well. well that's about. So to see how well we're doing. Yeah, still got a fair bit, three quarters to go. Getting there though, shouldn't take too long. And then on the way home, end of the week, yay! <laughs> Trucking Friday, but which is Monday really, but it's my Friday if that makes sense. So, hey ho! <laughs> so I'm admiring my new camera, which actually. Well, we're sat here, and I'm sorry I'm getting this off the phone, but I'll do the shout out Well, I remember. As I know what I'm like, I'll get carried away with talking about something, and I'll forget what I need to be actually doing in terms of what I need to tell you. Uh, so, um, da, 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 here we go. I'll give uh, uh, sorry, I'll give Max's uh, trucking a shout out because he's been supporting the channel from pretty much the beginning. So yes, again, another massive shout out. Go and check out his channel, please. You know if you can. You know so he does. As I said he, he shows a lot of sport on this channel. So I'll, you know, give him another shout out. He's always commenting. Always, you know, always seems to be watching. <laughs> Uh, we've also had, I think, a new subscriber this week, so it's, it's passing down a wee bit on subscriber fun. We're up to about 131 today, which, wow, you know, I mean, doing well. You know, as I said, I, was, I think I said in the last vlog, I was amazed how many I picked up when I wasn't actually vlogging. When I had my, uh, it's elapsed in terms of uh, putting content out there. So, yeah, so. That's the main shout. I think there was another shout out I was going to do, but I'm not too sure. I'll probably do that in another one coming up. But Max's trucking videos, please go and check out his uh, his YouTube channel. And uh, obviously, if you do go across, sorry about that, to his channel, let him know where you've come from. And yeah, so today has been a Wednesday, a normal, fairly productive day. Started in London, loaded in London, up to farm, ran Long Parish Andover, then up to the customer just north of Shipton Mallet, of it, Pimtrol Regulars, and to here near Chipton. And then we'll be heading back towards Andover, sort of way home. So, yeah, pretty good day. Pretty good going, not a major distance day for trucking wise, you know, but kind of average day. Yes, and a good day. Yeah, good way to finish the week off, as I say. The farmer is also saying uh, he's had issues with electricity, I think, so uh, I was wondering why it was a bit dark down here when I was reversing the end, and he has his lights on and all that. But, uh, never mind. When I boot it up, it's my light reflecting off. So yeah, so, so hopefully you like this new kind of format of my vlogging. I will try and implement probably this format kind of into other videos as well I do. And so I'm enjoying actually doing the time lapse intro roll in. It just makes it a bit different, I think, each time. It's not like I'm replaying the same intro, the same intro. I can always put something above it, which I'm looking at doing. So I'm just learning a different program to do a bit of uh, hopefully either animation or something like that but we'll see I can't promise anything that might be a bit further down the line but we're getting there hopefully you've enjoyed today's vlog 
in terms of the quality. Uh, so I'm not too sure on the upload if it will be 1080p or try at, at YouTube's uh, so-called 4K, which is kind of 2K dependent, you know, how you work all that out. Um, but I may upload it like that so you get the best quality I can give you. But we'll see. I'll see how I edit it first. At least editing-wise, it will give the best quality so I can... Uh, you know, lower the quality down if needs be, so you always get the better, or the best it could have been, if that makes sense. Yeah, so, before I wumble on about anything else, I don't really have a huge amount to say, really, today. It's, I wanted to vlog today. I wanted to vlog yesterday, but I said, with what went on yesterday, I thought, no, I'd start again. As I don't want to do a negative vlog if I can help it. That deserves its own video and its own right. So, I don't worry, it's nothing bad at the end of the day. It's just an issue that is not just in the trucking world, but also, you know, but it, just because of the nature of the job, it's a bit more of an issue in some terms. But uh, I'll tease you on that one a wee bit and I'll save that for a future video. And uh, yeah, so. Anything else? As I said, I've done the shout out, done all that. I will probably see you next time. Please, uh, if possible, if you like what you see on this channel, you got any ideas, please feel free to comment down below. To all those who have subscribed to my channel, thank you very much. You are very much appreciated. You know, yet again, thank you. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, just please smash that subscribe button. It does help the channel out a lot comment down below as I keep on saying hit the like button if you like what you see or dislike button if you want to uh, it's all but at the end of the day it's all <laughs> acknowledgement at the end of the day um, anything else go check out my Instagram which I do I'm trying to post at least once a week if not more troll in other words trying to more readily post on Instagram so uh also check out my Facebook as well. So yet again, I will say a massive thank you to everybody. Thank you very much for all watching. I'm Steve O Trucker, and I'll see you in the next one. Over and out. <laughs>